What's going on guys? I'm Jake of Upfast Games and this is Broken Age Part 3. Um, so basically what just happened was, uh, sorry, I keep on forgetting her name, um, but she basically just uh, rebelled against the whole Maiden's Feast thing and uh, told the Mog Chothra to go fuck himself and uh, pretty much used this bird to get there, or to get away from that whole thing, and uh, now she's up in the clouds, in some sort of cloud city it seems. So uh, we'll do kind of the same basic thing. First half of the video will be uh, with her, and then the other half of the video will be with Shay. I think I need to use a ladder to get up there. Do ya? This looks like a fountain, but it's flat. Much lighter that way. Looks like I should go that direction for more clouds. Hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and look Hi at there. a few more things. Uh oh. So I don't want to stand in the clouds for too long. Let's get some cloud shoes. Careful! Ah. Oh no! I told you to be careful. It's okay. It's just my whole livelihood is gone. Is all. I'm sunk. I have a knife. So, what's your name? Carl? Carl? No. Carl. It's Carol, with some of the letters removed for reasons that are too stupid to repeat. Yeah, it is stupid. Hey, can I ask you about those weird guys down there? My husband and son? Uh, what did they do this time? Is that all of them? Well, there's McGee, my teenager, off with her head in the clouds somewhere. You know what I mean. <laughs> it's funny, because clouds get it. I think they're going to hurt somebody with those sticks. Oh, my husband would never do that. Harmony has rules against fighting here. Harmony? Harmony Lightbeard, the supposed guru my husband followed up here. I think he's a nut, but I let my husband have his hobbies. Your husband is following a guru? He moved the whole family up here so we could study Harmony Lightbeard's philosophy of lightness. It's a midlife crisis thing. I'm just playing along. I don't think those guys down there are working as hard as you are. Oh, I think they are, since I lost my knife. You must be very proud. Honey, I'm just trying to survive this phase, honestly. I wish he had just had an affair like most middle-aged men instead of dragging us all up here. Okay, enough about your family. Oh, sorry. Was I going on about them again? Sorry. About what? About your knife. Oh, right. My knife. <laughs> Balls. You can't make hats without a knife? Hats? I make life-saving cloud shoes here. Or I did. Until you came along. You make shoes out of clouds? Uh, no, shoes that keep you from sinking into clouds. They spread out your weight. Buoyancy is all about that. Wait, I know this. Uh, that would be volume, I believe. Volume? Pounds per square inch. Skinny little feet like yours shoot through clouds like chopsticks through whipped cream. Oh, okay. I was, okay. <laughs> Uh, do you really eat whipped cream with chopsticks? Do you really eat whipped cream with chopsticks? Only when I'm feeling sad. Why don't you use your teeth? Shoes made of teeth? That's creepy. Well, I'll let you get back to your work. Ah, my work. Okay, then. I have a knife. I do not have a knife. Never mind. I thought I had a knife. I could have sworn I had a knife. Hey, can you make me a pair of cloud shoes? Well, I can't make anything without my knife. Well, I'll let you get back to your work. Ah, oh, my work. What the fuck happened to my knife? This is bullshit. I want my fucking knife. I'll kill someone to get it. No, no, no. Hi, Shit. I'm Mag... Mm. McGee. Hey, what's up? <sighs> Nothing. What did you say your name was? McGee. It's Maggie, but without the A. 
My dad's idea. Your dad's pretty stupid. Don't you mind that your dad took the A out of your name? Well, yeah, but my dad said, hey, losing an A is better than losing an I. <laughs> <laughs> your dad's pretty creepy. He wasn't before he joined this cult. Oh, whoops, did I say that too loud? Your dad's in a cult? Ah, uh, he's just taking this light beard worship a little too far. But it's okay. At least it got him out of his line dancing phase. What are you doing exactly? I'm taking care of these eggs. If it weren't for me, they'd, uh, get dusty or something. How do you get to the eggs in the high nests? Oh, because I'm so short, you mean? No, I, uh... I'm just messing with you. Ha. Huh. I have a ladder. She was just messing with us. Hey, can I borrow your ladder? Mm, okay. Huh, that's awfully small. Hey, short things can surprise you, okay? True. Hey, is there any way off this cloud? Think I'd be here if there were? We used to have a cool feather vader that went straight down to the forest below. But Harmony took it out. Why'd they take out the Feather Vader? Harmony decided that nobody had any reason to leave. Maybe I should just jump. Tried it. No good. Whoopsie birdie guards catch you and bring you back. What you need is a ladder. But it would have to be much taller than mine. Lightbeard's really serious about this lightness thing, isn't he? Oh yeah. People say he only eats feathers. Ick, but it's not true. Good. He only licks them. Gah. Hey, what kind of bird lays those golden eggs? Oh, those? Those are egg substitutes. We make them for the older, senile gulls who forget they don't have eggs. Why are they made of gold? It's the heaviest stuff we have. We want them to be heavy, so the gulls can't carry them off and lose them. Hey, nice cloud shoes. Duh. My mom made them for me. All the other kids have cool name brand cloud shoes, but I get homemade. Oh, but don't tell her I said that. The shoe thing is all she's got. Well, I'll leave you alone. <sighs> okay. Sorry, I hope you guys didn't hear that little bit of creakiness. Um, uh, well, for two separate reasons. I adjusted my headset and my chair. Uh, oh, I have a ladder now, right. Of course. Um, I guess I want to get that golden egg. Can't get up there. Ah, there we go. I'm good. I'm good. Oh, fuck you. Hey, knock it off. Those hooks are an important safety feature. Sheesh. That was rude. I'll fucking pluck you. Uh oh. It sinks without the hooks. Jerk bird. This is all your fault. I'm gonna kill that bird. I am going to kill that bird. That's how this is going to end. No, let me. Better not touch those. I don't want to make these giant I, I birds wanna angry leave. at me. Let me leave. Okay, it doesn't seem to want to let me leave. Okay. Um, how else do I do this it's then? It's extendable. That is one heavy-looking egg. I mean, oh, that—that's a thing of some sort. Better not touch those. No. I don't want to make these giant birds angry at me. Okay, so, I mean, I can't... I don't know what to do. It'll probably knock me off again. Yeah, it's gonna tell me to go fuck off. Awesome. Hey, knock it off! Those hooks are an important safety... Okay, sorry about that. Now that I know how to skip cutscenes, I'll do that. Ah, here we go. Good, now I, now I know that I could... I can go back, so that's good. I'll go way hi. back. No, shut up. Don't don't say hi to me. Hey, welcome back. Shut up. 
I would say that I'm happy to be here, but I'm not. Because I hate all of you. I hate everyone here. I hate that. I hate that. I hate those fucking people. Please place your offering into the bowls of enlightening. It's empty. Yes. That is why I said that thing about making an offering. Can I go up that ladder? Yes, after you place an offering in the bowl. Hi, are you? You may call me Fathur. Oh, yes, excuse me, Father. No, Fathur. Like a light, beautiful feather. That's but stupid. Lighter. Everyone Tell here is stupid. I hate name. all of you. It's quite an honor. What are you guarding here? I make sure that Brother Lightbeard's time is not wasted. He's a busy man, you know. So, you're Mr. Lightbeard's heavy? Hey, there's no call for personal insults. Can I go up and see Mr. Lightbeard? Just let me go. All are welcome on Brother Lightbeard's cloud after they make an offer. What kind of offering? It's not the object that matters, but the thought behind it. Huh. Weird. Do you think Harmony could tell me how to get off this cloud? Oh, I wouldn't ask Brother Lightbeard that. It would totally get him down. <laughs> As if that's possible. He is so buoyant. I don't suppose there's a big ladder like this that goes down. <sighs> Last time I checked, most ladders go both directions. Huh. That's funny. Can I just go up the ladder without making an offering? Brother I like that idea. gives you this opportunity to lighten your load for your benefit, not his. Uh-huh. I'll let you get back to work. Stay light. Alright, fuck this shit. I'm trying to think of a way that I can uh, get that golden egg. Because I have the ladder now, so that's good. Hi, my name is Bella. What's yours? I am Walt Er. Walter? Walt Er. You'd think she'd figure it out by now. We admire lightness in all things. No extra baggage, no extra letters. I'm chick. Who are you guys? We're the preeners, of course. We take care of the nests and keep stuff floating. Super important. Can you guys help me? I need to get back to sugar bunting right away. You're from sugar bunting? So that's why you smell like frosting. What's the big rush? Stay here and float a while. I just escaped the Maiden's Feast, and now Mog Chathra is going to eat the town. You what? Why would you ever run away from such an honor? Such a joyous occasion. Hopefully the upcoming ceremonies in Shell Mound go more smoothly. We just had our Maiden's Feast yesterday. It was awesome! Brother Lightbeard was very pleased. Good luck topping that one, <laughs> Smell Mound. Well, I just thought maybe we could fight Mog Chathra instead of feeding it. Oh, that sounds horrible. Why would anyone want to hurt such a noble, endangered creature? Poor Mog Chathra. Look, I just need to get home right away. We have no way off this cloud. Because no one wants to leave. Mom says she does, but she doesn't really. Right, Dad? Uh... Did you say that the next Maiden's Feast was in Shell Mound? Yes. It's so sad. I mean, they're always trying to compete with us, but... Oh, please. Shell Mound girls smell like old seaweed. How do I get to Shell Mound? Um, follow the stink? Ha 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 ha. Let's go back to talking about Mariloft. I knew this magical place would win you over eventually. Who's Jesse? That big blue oligol you rode in on. Oh, really? 
I guess I owe her a thank you. Actually, take my advice. Stay away. Why shouldn't I talk to Jessie? Well, one of her eggs went missing when she was out. She's totally freaking out. Yes, I don't think the golden egg substitute we put in her nest is fooling her. Poor Jessie. Where did her egg go? It's against the greener code to point fingers. But Gus was on cleaning duty. And it wouldn't be the first time that oaf fell Shh, short. Shh, son. Remember what Brother Lightbeard said. Lou speaks. Cause leaks. Any idea where I can find Jesse's egg? If Gus really did take it, well, he is a little... dense. Mentally and physically. <laughs> he probably fell through the clouds and went splat in the forest. I hope he did. Can you tell me about Brother Lightbeard? Happy to. Harmony Lightbeard is a brilliant philosopher, spiritualist, and buoyancy instructor. We have followed Brother Lightbeard up to the clouds to learn about his philosophy of lightness. Dad gave him all our money. Quiet, chit. Oh, yeah. It's a surprise for Mom's birthday. Don't the birds tend the nests? Well, these birds are not exactly model homemakers. Left to their own devices, they'll lay too many eggs or get too fat. And then, poof, they'll sink right through the clouds. Don't blow, stay afloat. How are we floating on these clouds anyway? Volume. No, son. Try again. Jeez. Um, okay. Uh, circumference? The area. area. Yeah. Yeah, I thought so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all about... I can't believe I got that one wrong. That's so... Ugh. I well, just feel like an I'll idiot. I'll see you two later. Farewell. Stick to the paths. Stay on the twigs or you'll... Eat a pig! No freestyling, Chit. Sorry, Pop. Just kill them both. I think I need to use a ladder to get up there. Yep, you would. I need to find my knife, too. And stab this fucking bird so I can take its. Hello. Um. Hey, thanks for saving my life back there. Sorry I said you were part vulture. Give me, give me that. I want that. Hey, girl. Alright, fine, hey, fuck you. Hey, settle down. I'm going to find your missing egg for you, okay? Can I make an, like, I thought that the offering would be the egg. Maybe I'm incorrect in that. Uh oh, no, don't want that. I think I need to use a ladder to get up there. Oh, here's a thing. Actually, you know what? I think I'm just going to dedicate this entire video to this part. Wow. Yeah, this one's just going to be about Vela. Hello. Hi. Hi. So, uh, how's the view up there? I don't know. All I can see is my mother's disappointed face. That's sad. I really like your outfit. Yeah, I liked it too. Not good enough, though, apparently. And on top of that, the shoes were too tight. Did you say something about shoes? Yeah, why? You need some? Take these. I don't need any. Yay! I'm happy now. I'm gonna sit here forever. What are you doing down here? I'm an offering for the Maiden's Feast. You can't tell? Jeez, it's worse than I thought. I was in a Maiden's Feast too. Just today, in fact. Oh, really? You didn't get picked either? Well, no, I got picked. But I put up a fight and got away. You... What? I just figured, why not fight the monster, you know? Yeah, right. He didn't get picked. That's okay. Pull up a swing and sulk with me, sister. Kind of shabby looking for a maiden's feast. Hey, I can't help the way I look. No, I mean the broken bird cages and feathers. Oh, yeah. Well, that's because the feast is over. 
Need help? Uh, cleaning up? Why bother? Well, it's just... kind of a mess down here. So am I. That's why I like it. If the feast is over, what are you doing here? Rub it in, why don't you? I'm still here because I didn't get picked, okay? Look on the bright side. You didn't get eaten by a monster. I'd rather do that than face my family right now. Who am I kidding? They've probably already jumped off a cloud in shame by now. Look, I think it's time we start fighting that monster. You're just going through that anger phase after not getting picked. That was me yesterday. Well, I'll leave you alone. Just like Mark Chathra did. I'm used to it. So I just put these on? Yay! I have shoes now. Those, those help me, kind of. I suppose. So I can... I can stand on... Oh, shit. Hey, it saved me. That's good. I get yeah, there was like kind of a vortex looking thing right there, I suppose. But I am able to stand on the clouds though without falling now, so that's good. Um Hi. I I think that I said everything I so can to her, but here? Are you making fun of me? I'm just checking out. Okay, no, I've already, well, I've already asked everything to her. <sighs> okay. Oh, hey, there's my knife. Hey, that's my knife. Good thing it didn't land on anybody. Yeah, I got it. So I'm gonna use this that's knife to stab that bird over there and then get the golden egg. We'll just see if I can do that. I would love to. It's not gonna work, but I, I just I want to stab that little fucker for being such an such an asshole. Come on, let me stab him. Let me stab him. Fuck. All right, fine. I'll go ahead and give the knife to that lady. Go faster. Hi. Okay, bitch. You want your knife? Here's your knife. Well, well I'll let you get back the to your thing work. is, <laughs> my work. We'll see. Say, that's some knife. Good balance, nice heft. Ooh, and a blood gutter. No, that's for the filling. The less I know about the knife's history, the better. Here. Well, Thanks. hold on. Uh, I know, they're big, but you'll grow into them. Trust me, you hit 40 and you're gonna be grateful for a pair of comfortable shoes like that. Maybe I can... Well, hold on a second. Yeah, I have two different pairs. Now, of These the... These things are so big, they won't even stay on my feet. Okay, so yeah, the big ones I'll, I'll use as an offering. How about that? Please place your if he tells me some bullshit about how it's not good enough, I'm gonna be pissed. These things are so big, they won't even stay offering. on my feet. Really? Harmony will be pleased. Awesome. Go talk to this motherfucker. What? How can anybody climb that? Hi. Oh my. A fresh face rises from below. Before you ask, let me answer. Yes, you may live here in Maryloft forever. 
Who are you? I am Harmony Lightbeard, the lifter of clouds. Why do you have laces and a big bow in your cloud? Oh, why, well, you see, I exude such a powerful aura of lightness, it's made these clouds hyperbuoyant. If I didn't lash them together, they'd fly away into the heavens. Why are you up here so high? I'm exactly as high up from Mariloft as Mariloft is from the forest below. To show that we're all equals. I don't get it. That makes It'll no start sense. It makes sense after a few weeks of meditation, my child. Any idea where Jesse's egg went? Ah, uh, losing objects is a natural step in the path to enlightenment. It's part of who we are in Mariloft. It's in our roots. Do not fear it. Can you help me kill Mog Chathra? Ah, what a thing to say. Hey! Did you just lay that? No, it fell out of my pile of... Did you, he just shat a golden egg. Pay no attention to that. I wish I could shit gold. That'd be fantastic. Hey, are you done with that golden egg? That's mine. I might need it someday. Uh, I mean, take it away. I need it like a blue jay needs a bowling ball. Oops! Heads up for there! Oh. Actually, I just want to get off this cloud. Oh, I understand. You're quite mentally ill, aren't you? Have no fear, you've come to the right place. I really, really want to get off this cloud. Do you have any idea what would happen if people could just leave Mariloft whenever they felt like it? Mariloft would become lighter? Hmm, hadn't thought of that. But no. Everyone would leave? What? No! I could go kill Mogchathra? What an offensive idea. No! People would become... Unenlightened. So because I care so much, we have the Whoop Suburdy Network to make escape. I mean, <clears throat> unenlightenment impossible. Thanks for the help. See you later. Be light, child. Or for there. Uh oh. He's breathing. He's dead. No, he's not. Okay. Thought he was dead. Oh man, this thing is heavy. Good thing I have these cloud shoes on. Now then, let's see if I can give him this, uh, this golden egg. No. I think I need to use a ladder to get up there. I don't think that will fool her. She's really? a mom after all. Alright, well, let's fool the other one then. I'm sure the other Hi. the other one wouldn't give a shit. I could maybe scramble them if they weren't solid gold. I mean, what? Hey, anyone up there want a free egg? No? I'm pretty sure the same thing's going to happen here, so I'm a little confused. Oh god damn it. All right. Um Hey bird, you're a jerk. Maybe if I'm just closer. Nope. I guess not. Well, I don't know what the fuck to do then. I could maybe scramble them if they weren't solid gold. All right then. I have absolutely no idea. This is a tricky one. Hi. Hey. All right. Um maybe maybe we can try it. It's not going to work. I guarantee fucking tea it's not going to work, but I'm going to try it anyway. Oh, I can go. I didn't realize that. Okay. Well, first let's see. I don't think that will fool no? her. Okay. Fine. She is a mom after all. Yeah, we'll fuck her. Man, that sign really did not do this thing justice.
I'm a little confused as to what this is supposed to do. Oh, so that doesn't do shit then. Okay. That seemed kind of pointless. Hey, listen, oh, hey. I can explain. I was taking Jesse's egg for a cleaning and... Hey, wait, wait, who are you? You're in big trouble, young man. Oh, man, don't tell Harmony, okay? He already has it in for me. Why don't you just let go? I'm 85% sure someone would catch you. I'm stuck! I'm caught on this branch and I can't reach back that far! What are you really doing down here? I was just chasing some fruit that fell off that tree and I hit a weak spot in the clouds. Why would Jesse's egg need cleaning anyway? Well, it, it didn't, but I needed the work credits to make up for some hygiene demerits I got last week. Mind if I just squeeze past you? Yeah, that's a good idea. Come over here so I can grab on. No way. Well, you hang in there, kid. Now just get over here. Grab my underwear and unhook it from this branch. Sorry, I'm not going anywhere near your underwear. Come here and h help me. Fine, just do it. Hey! Great! Now let me just climb under your shoulders. Quit it! <laughs> you fucking I douche. I was, I was trying to help him out. Like, why can't I? Because this bitch is too grossed out. I'm not I'm not gonna let your inhibitions fuck up my you know, tasks, alright? I'm gonna do what I want to. Are you finally here to help or what? Yes. God damn well, it. You hang in there, kid. This my is underwear. fucking stupid. It's on the branch. Can you unhook it, please? Unhook my underwear. I'll throw an egg at you. Hey, if I give you a golden egg substitute, would that help? Ah, it helped me sink to my death, which I don't wanna do. Alright, fuck it. God, this is really annoying me. I'm starting to not like Vela. Seriously? Just go. I can't... Alright, fuck it. It's empty. I don't know, this maybe. This big old heavy egg won't no. do any good there. What the fuck? Are you finally here to help or what? Yes. Hey! Oh my Great. god, this now is fucking ridiculous. Under your shoulders. This is fucking ridiculous. And I thought I was clumsy. Alright, um, you know what, fuck this. Uh, I'm closing out the video here. Um, I'll try to figure it out in the next part, so, uh... Yeah, nobody gives a shit. Uh, so if you enjoyed the video, feel free to like and subscribe and all that, and I'll see you guys next time.